Hello everyone, I'm Light Supernatic Gigsjaw, and this is kind of episode 3 of the Slender series, but not really. Um, mostly just showing off what I've done, in case you guys aren't really uh, sure what to do. So I added moss, bushes, rocks, flowers, and everything to the grass. And then I also took rocks, and I <clears throat> you know, placed them all around to make a wall. I then merged all of them so the it's it's less taxing because it's not a bunch of individual models. It's all just well, it's technically two because uh, I wasn't happy with the height, but you get the point. So this is what mine's looking like now, and this video is just a uh, some things I wanted to change to the character. You don't have to. This is my personal thing. I'm just showing how. To do it. So the first thing is the character is too fast in my opinion. Uh, we'll add a sprint button down the line, but for now I'm just going to change his max walk speed. That's a little under character movement, max walk speed. I'm going to change it to 300. That's going to yeah make him slower. And I'm also going to get rid of the jump because we don't need to jump. So if we just go in and test how that's like. Yeah, there we go. I'm walking now. Um, when we had a sprint button, be better. If you're not happy with this walking speed, you can always adjust it, of course. And I also really like the way the walls came out. This is going to look so much better once we add trees, but it's already looking really good. Um, yeah, you'll notice that uh, the, the landscape over there is flat. That's because of the culling distance. Again, once we add trees, it'll look better, but you can also change the culling distance in the landscape grass at the top there where we added all this you can change the culling distance if you want to be able to see it from further so yeah that's everything with this video it's just a really quick one thank you guys goodbye